we are right here, we are right here. It's me, Antonio, from Capiris Bros, the quality manager. Today, we are here in Bowen, Northern Queensland. And we are here with Petty, that is looking after our farm with Clay, that you met last time, and Joe. And uh, here we are on our proven variety, the main variety that we grow. Yep. Obviously, we plant a fair bit of seeds of this. Yep. In this patch, we plant on about uh, 100,000. Oh, beautiful. It's a lot of work, man. Yeah, yeah. And that is just one. Yeah, a lot of manpower. <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. And uh, talk to us about this variety. Um, it's going all right. It's pretty good. You know, there's lots of leaf still on this variety as well. Uh, good, good handed tomatoes there. Um, still good size, very good size. And uh, what are the challenges that are you facing? Uh, example right now, you should say it's quite warm. It's a bit cooler at night, like yep. we're talking about 15 degrees, but over through the day, we're reaching 30. So what are your biggest challenges right now? Well, and the heat's starting to come on, so we are picking, we're gonna start picking a bit more. So, so chasing the crops and stuff, yeah, yeah? keeping on top of getting a crop off before it colors up too much. Yeah. Um, so we're talking about harvesting a bit like a sort of half a colour or quarter colour or something like yeah, that? Yeah, just, yeah, yeah, half, it's coming on Start to break a bit through, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're just picking every second day sort of thing, not leaving it so long to colour up a bit. And what about pests? What are, are now? Uh, it was, um, yeah, it was slower back then in the colder. Okay. So, but now it's just starting to heat up. So, so yeah. you need to uh, walk more, more, more of the crops yeah. and... Uh, Keep the, we definitely got to keep the water up to them. They'd, water up, yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, they're more tasty, and uh, obviously check for any pests and stuff like green veggie bug and stuff like that. Yeah, yep, yeah. We keep on top of them, we get right. them in, and well, get rid of them. I can see between yourself and Clay and Joe, you're doing a great job because guys, look at this fruit. This is absolute fantastic, absolute amazing fruit. The shortly, I reckon. What, what, what's what? Couple of weeks, not even. Yeah, a couple more weeks right the top be, there. Yeah. Down here, another week or so. Yeah. And they'll be, it'll be coming on. This fruit, like Petty says, in one week or couple, it'll be right on your table from Queensland Pride, uh, Etoff Farm, uh, Capiris Bros. But before we go, I want to talk to you with my man here, Petty, about something. Something that happened. There's a lot of work happening right now here. So explain to us what's going on here. Why we do this? In March we had a cyclone, massive cyclone. Uh, we got a massive downfall of um, rain. Yeah. And so a bit, bit of pooling here and the dam was full up. Yeah, it filled the dam up, it was full. Um, and on our first pipe that we've installed last year, couldn't let the water out fast enough, was which was flooding our block 18 that had already had plastic in it. Uh, it went broken because of the damage of the, from the Yes. The cycle, yeah. Okay, so we're avoiding to have uh, um, uh, flooded crops or flooded yes. uh, land already prepared yep. with plastic plate and uh, trickles and stuff. So we don't we minimize damage and we make sure that we provide tomatoes to our customers yep. on time. This is the end of our journey. Uh, thank you all. Thank you for following us and push that like again, please. I love you all. Following us, Perry. Your goodbye. We'll see you next time. Definitely we will. Bye-bye.